Hello there everybody and warm welcome to my channel Tarot by Isabella. I hope you're all doing fine and I'm very happy to see you here. Today's video will be a short video about something that is occurring in many places around our planet and that is that the house plants are dying without no specific reason. I have noticed on my own house plants, and I have had uh, many people mail to me, and also in uh, my f uh, friend, around my friends, they are all complaining about the same thing, and that is that their house plants are dying. Strong, healthy house plants suddenly they start to, you know, crumbling down and getting weak and dies. And uh, also when you try to grow new uh, new plants, the little seedlings, uh, they seem like they don't have any life force or they don't want to grow and it goes very slowly or if they grow a little bit, then they die. And this I've, I've heard yeah, a lot about here in Sweden, people complaining about that, but also in other countries. And I'm going to look into that question, what is happening to the plants? Why are they lacking the life force of growing? What is killing them? Is it the air, water, or is it something else? And to do so, I'm going to use my tarot cards, oracle cards, gypsy cards, and some dice. So let's start about the house plants. Why, what is happening? to the house plants. I need to shuffle them a little first and let's see what is happening to our house plants. cards on that too. A gypsy card. And some dice. I need some extra cards. Uh, these are the seedlings. What is killing them? It looks like this. <clears throat> well, the cards confirm here we have the child is like the seedlings and temperance. It's going slow, they're not really uh, growing as they sh should. And we have a poor guy in the center of the dice, and there is 
poor energy. And we also have past life relationship and death and son. Uh, yes, so something is happening to our uh, plants that they are not having, they're lacking the life force. And the sun is also an energy, could be some magnetic storms from the sun that is affecting the plants, uh, making them, I say, get out of balance yeah, in, in the growth cycle. And it's like very stressful for the plants, since we also have five of wands, that is stress. It looks like this will be manageable, because we have six of wands, success. And there will be some kind of change in the near future that will help the plants to begin to grow again. Uh, we also have the priest in the center, that is something spiritual. I'm going to take one card on the priest. Mm. Uh, in a spiritual manner, mm. some kind of energy, spiritual energy that is disturbing the plants from growing. Uh, overall, it looks like uh, whatever's going on with the plants, that they are dying, uh, it will turn around and make them grow even better. So if they are not feeling good, well, something will happen on a spirit spiritual level and that will help the plants to grow again. Mm. Um, yeah. I'm not going to take some more cards on this. Is it the sun, the magnetic field from the solar flares that are bombarding Earth at the moment? Or is it something more that are killing, uh, that is killing our plants? And is it more than the solar flares, magnetic storms? something that is coming from far away yeah and it's traveling here um, some kind of radiation mm, I get a strong feeling of some kind of negative radiation it could also mean negative energy we have the nine of sword uh, our planet at the moment are uh, like in a big thick blanket of negative energy, some kind of suffocating uh, energy that steals uh, life power. So this negative energy is also one of the reasons. Um, in combination with the solar flare magnetic storms, all kind of radiation, and we also have the 5G towers, of course, but uh, not in all places there are 5G towers that, mm, that you can say are killing the plants. Because we had 5G towers last year and they were growing okay, but this year, it's like pff, last month, it's going really down. So I would say a combination of solar flare magnetic storm, some kind of radiation, and negative energy uh, that is suffocating planet Earth at the moment. 
uh, with all of those evil energies that are really trying to what do you say destroy as much as they can before they are eliminated even if the plants are suffering at the moment it still seems like everything will calm down and they will begin to grow again mm. and this will be manageable let's take some last cards on this question why are the house plants dying plants die mm. again mm. it's as yeah we have sickness uh, we have the tower, four of swords, and the white lilies. They are dying. They have not enough life force. Mm. And this will be balanced up. And again, I get a strong feeling it's this really negative energy that is bombarding planet Earth everywhere and sucking the life force out of um, the plants and the humans and all the living but it will be de dealt with we have the justice here so it will change we are coming um, it looks like we are coming into a new era of mankind mm. when all this parasitic energies evil energies uh, will be dealt with and it will be a time of recovery after that. Mm. Three of Swords. Yeah. So there is some very bad energies at the moment that are sucking the life out of house plants and living creatures. Uh, but we must stay positive. We must try to download as much life force as we can and in some some way higher the vibrations on our planet and the higher vibration the more light we can download into this darkness and the quicker the change will come also but big changes are coming they are on the way well, that was my answer for why are the houseplants dying. And if you have liked what you have seen and heard, please don't forget to press like button, share button and subscription button. And to all of you wonderful viewers, thank you so much for watching. Wishing all the best for you. Take care out there. Be strong. Uh, don't fall down in too much negative thoughts and emotions. We must keep a high vibration to save our planet and to help save our planets, our planet and uh, the future for our children. Wish you all the best and uh, hopefully we're going to see each other soon again. Bye bye.